Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix Roblox authentication failed error code 403 and error was encountered during the authentication. If you get this message while playing any game on your Roblox player, follow the simplest steps that will be surely working for you. And if this works for you, please consider subscribing to the channel. It's absolutely free. Like the video. And still, if you have the issue, then let me know in the comment section. The very first thing that you have to do is you need to close your Roblox player from your task manager. So just make a right click on your windows icon. Choose task manager. Now here you have to look for Roblox game client. So just click on it. Then click on end task. Now once it's been completed. Now the chances are the problem are with some kind of DNS or due to some kind of network. So we will also run some kind of. Uh, DNS flush and network reset command click on your search box type here CMD then from the option choose run as administrator the black window will be coming up here the first command that you need to type will be NETSH net winsock reset the command you will be getting in the description you can copy the command from the description and paste here once done hit enter now the another command will be ip config space flush dns hit enter again and you see that the both the commands have been successfully completed but it asks you to restart the computer in order to complete the reset so what we will do we are remaining with two more simple steps we need to complete that and finally we will make a restart now close this box and now again in the search box type ncpa.cpl from the suggestion choose this option and cpa.cpl control panel item now the network connection box will be coming up and you will see all kind of connection over here now depending that what kind of connection you are using you need to make a right click on it so if you are using wi-fi make a right click on wi-fi if you are using ethernet like me then you have to make a right click on it then choose properties here you'll find internet protocol version 4 double click on it and probably this option should be set to obtain dns server address automatically you have to check the below option that says use the following dns server address and in the preferred dns address you have to type 888 and 8 in the alternate dns it will be 884 and 4 now click on ok then click on ok again and now close this box now in the last step and the final step we have to also try deleting the roblox local folder from your windows pc so just press windows and r key to bring up the run box and it will come up at the very left hand corner here you have to type percent local app data percent again then click on ok now here you have to look for the roblox folder here it is just make a right click on it and choose delete once it's been deleted you have to restart your pc and after restarting next time when you launch your roblox player through the browser or directly from your pc you won't be having any problem hopefully this will work for you guys and if yes consider subscribing to the channel like the video and in case if still if you have the issues then please let me know in the comment section with the full brief that what you tried and is still how you are having the trouble. Alright so guys I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.